Hi, beautiful people. I am creating another one-of-a-kind arrangement. It is Noah's Ark themed. So I purchased Noah's Ark theme arrangements and they come with these beautiful, cute little inserts here. You take this little rhino and you can put it in. Now see how it fell through like that? It's not going to work because I'm using the base of this arc as the actual vessel. And I also intend to use this top as a separate arrangement piece. So you'll have the base here and then you will have a separate piece for the top. Blooms are gonna come out of here, okay? And I will have a container in here, fill it with blooms, but I cannot have gaps here. Otherwise, you will see through to the container that's holding the stems. So no need to fret. I have a box, floral tape, Velcro, and scissors. It's all that I need to make this secure. So what I'm going to do is I am going to cut some of this box to fit the shape of this section here. And then from there, I am going to Velcro the box to the arch and then use a little floral tape to secure the edges. And then with the little animals, they'll each get a little bit of a Velcro strip and they will be adhered to the box, okay? Stay tuned how it turns out all right so this is one of the finished sides of the arrangement I want to make sure that as guests at the shower are sitting down that the pieces don't fall out due to them bumping into it getting their plates and shaking so I've made sure it is super super secure you'll see on this side you've got the box you can see the floral tape that's securing the box and this is just a box that I have on hand that my kids play with. And there's also Velcro underneath this to help secure it to the base. So just imagine there's Velcro, like a Velcro piece here, Velcro piece here, Velcro piece here. And then I took the animals and they have little Velcro pieces. And so they would normally fall out, but now they're secured in place. And what I love, love, love about this so much is that this toy is brand new. It is a gift to the baby and to the family. They will be able to play with this after the blooms um, fade away, right? So you're going to have beautiful blooms coming out of this. Once the event is over, once the blooms are no longer beautiful like they were when I dropped them off, you can take the blooms out of here, disassemble this very gently, take off the Velcro, and the baby has a brand new gift with cute little rainbow, with the ark sitting on top. Like, it's a toy. It's a toy that they can play with after the florals are done. So stay tuned, I am so excited about this. I mean, every time I do a creative project, I get nervous because I don't know how it's going to turn out and I really am flowing with the Holy Spirit and praying the whole time and I'm literally saying to the Lord, Lord, please don't let this flop because I am doing this in your name. Please help me. Please help me find the appropriate florals for this. Please help me find the appropriate vessels for this. Please help the client to be so pleased. Please help the arrangement to endure the event and last a little while longer. Like it's just filled with prayer and help them to just be pleased. And so I'm just thankful that this is coming together. I am thankful that I had the materials on hand, like the box, like the Velcro. I am thankful for hearing the Lord, like kind of talking to me. Because at first I was thinking, okay, well, I'll just use some, um, like this, this um, felt and slide it in the hole like this. And then the thought came to me, that's not going to work because it's too flimsy, right? To hold wood and then the wood would adhere, but they would maybe be like kind of droopy. So there's just so much that goes into the creative process, but I love it when you can get through the sunken place and come back up like Noah's Ark. <laughs>